7.7 magnitude earthquake shook southwestern Pakistan Tuesday, destroying countless houses in the remote region. Though the massive quake was responsible for the deaths of dozens, it seems the seismic event also birthed something else, a new island. Shortly after the Pakistan earthquake, witnesses said a small island appeared near the port of Gwadar, off the southern coast of the country, according to the Associated Press. It appears the earthquake caused the seabed near the Gwadar coastline to rise. A rocky formation now juts above the water and is visible from the coast. As NDTV reports, the piece of land is estimated to span about 40 square feet. Local. It's going to be a mighty earthquake that is going to hit this country. A very mighty earthquake is going to hit this country. It is going to be a historic earthquake that is coming to this country and it's going to be comparable to the first earthquake that took place in Pakistan. Again, the Lord has spoken with me about a very, very powerful earthquake that is now going to touch this country. And now I can release this information after the first meeting that there is going to be a mighty historic earthquake hit this country, the country called Pakistan. The Lord has spoken a very, very heavy earthquake that will hit this country, Pakistan. So they may know that he has sent me here and he has sent me with a lot of power but he's asking that they may repent and prepare the way for the coming of the Lord Jesus. Praise the Lord, prophet of God. Amen, Pastor Faustin. This is what the Lord says. The Lord has spoken with me about a situation that is coming to befall the earth. And this is what the Lord says. The Lord brought me to a place, and in that place, the Lord asked me to speak judgment to that land. And the voice of the Lord said, these are the signs for the coming of the Messiah. That the people of the Lord may prepare for the coming of the Messiah. And then when I spoke the judgment of the Lord over that place, then the wrath of the Lord, the wrath of God Almighty, befell the land in that conversation. And then I saw a massive earthquake take place. A massive earthquake take place. Well... I see a building, I see an earthquake take place, and I see the earthquake strike a tall building, and the area and the surrounding, and the Lord put me in that earthquake, so I already ran for my life, and the tall building was broken by the earthquake, it was shaken and broken from the bottom and so it remains leaning for some time about to fall there will be a building probably many other buildings but I see one building a tall building and the earthquake breaks the building from around the first floor and people begin to run away because the building is going to fall when the aftershocks come I see that earthquake coming to the earth I see an earthquake of the Lord coming to the earth. I see an earthquake strike, violently shake the land. And in a very short time, I see a very tall building, a tall building, maybe not very tall, but it's quite tall, maybe very tall also, maybe other buildings also. But the earthquake breaks the building from around the first floor, from below, from down. And the Lord has already put me in that earthquake. I have already run for my life fearing that the building will fall on me. The words of my tongue, precious people. The words of my tongue. The word of my tongue. 
the words of my tongue, precious people, the words of the Lord, the holy words of Jehovah. I see an earthquake coming to the earth. I see people running when the earthquake strikes. I see an earthquake coming to the earth. an earthquake take place and I see the earthquake strike a tall building and the area and the surrounding and the Lord put me in that earthquake so I already ran for my life and the earthquake breaks the building from around the first floor and people begin to run away because the building going to fall when the aftershocks come and the Lord has already put me in that earthquake. I have already run for my life fearing that the building will fall on me. The words of my tongue, precious people. The words of my tongue. The word of my tongue. The words of my tongue, precious people. The words of the Lord. Over 75 people have been reported dead after an earthquake of 7.8 magnitude hit Balochistan province in southwest Pakistan. Rescue operations are underway as hundreds are still feared to be trapped under the rubble of collapsed buildings. an earthquake take place and I see the earthquake strike a tall building and the area and the surrounding and the Lord put me in that earthquake so I already ran for my life and the tall building was broken by the earthquake it was shaken and broken from the bottom and so it remains leaning for some time about to fall. There will be a building, probably many other buildings, but I see one building, a tall building, and the earthquake breaks the building from around the first floor, and people begin to run away because the building is going to fall when the aftershocks come. I see that earthquake coming to the earth, I see an earthquake of the Lord coming to the earth. I see an earthquake strike, violently shake the land. And in a very short time, 
I see a very tall building, a tall building, maybe not very tall, but it's quite tall, maybe very tall also, maybe other buildings also. But the earthquake breaks the building from around the first floor, from below, from down.